Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today's topic is about eight daily routine musts that will leave you fulfilled. Now remember, like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification bell to receive all of my content. Leave a comment below to let me know how you feel about this segment. Your response is highly appreciated. Definition of fulfilled, satisfied or happy because of fully developing one's ability and character. And it's principle for us of mankind to understand that it's daily routines that we must perform to leave us fulfilled in life. And it's principle for us of mankind to know what these routines are to leave us fulfilled in life. And I have arranged eight daily routine musts that will leave you fulfilled in life. We can become wore down from life challenges. We must recharge ourselves correctly to feel completely recharged. Point one, go to bed at a reasonable hour. It's principle for us of mankind to understand that we must go to bed at a reasonable hour at night on a daily basis because getting this proper rest will equip you to be prepared for your next day and also it will help to make your moods more able to manage and give you a more of a positivity to yourself as well because this daily routine of going to bed and getting the proper rest puts your body into a state of rest as well and you will be able to regulate all of your blood levels and things by lowering your blood pressure and getting the proper rest every day on a schedule. This will heal you in more ways than one. Number two, wake up like clockwork. It's principle for us of mankind to understand that when we get the proper rest at night, we should be able to hop up when the alarm clock goes off like clockwork and not be droggy or just moping around. No, we should be able to spring up full of energy and be well prepared for the day ahead. And we do this by getting the proper rest at night so we can feel inspired to get up when it's time to get up to conquer our day. Number three, make time for grooming. It's principle for us of mankind to understand that we must keep ourselves groomed at all times. This is something that we must do in order to improve our image, not just for no one else, but for ourselves, so that we will build a lasting image of ourselves that we carried ourselves a certain way and kept ourselves groomed. This is principle for us of mankind. Number four, show yourself who's the boss. It's principle for us of mankind to understand that when it comes to time that we have to do things that we may not feel up to doing or we may not be motivated or inspired to doing we have to show ourselves sometime who's the boss and go through with this and when we do apply our attention and focus to this job or whatever it is we are to apply our full total attention and focus and do the best, the very best that we can do. 
This is how we show ourselves who's the boss. Number five, leave work at work. It's principle for us of mankind that has families and a household to run as well as ourselves to manage. We must understand that we have to leave work at work. When work is done and the day is complete, you must leave everything there and apply your attention and your focus towards the things that you work for. And this is your family, your home, and yourself. And it's key and essential for you to focus in on leaving your work at work and to apply your attention to the things that matter most to you after work. Number six, give time to your loved ones. It's principle for us of mankind to give our time to the ones that means the most to us. And these are our loved ones. Yeah, we can get wrapped up into our day-to-day -day routine of life and trying to keep everything managed well. But we must allow ourselves time aside to see and visit our loved ones. The ones that we can't, they can't come see us. We should, we have to make time to go and see them and spend quality time with them and get caught up and updated on all of the details of things that's been going on in their lives, as well as update them on you as well. And it's important to stay in contact with these people on a daily basis so that you will feel fulfilled when it comes to thinking about this. Number seven, read every day. It's principle for us of mankind to know that we have to constantly read. Reading is fundamental. You can never learn enough. So it's principle for us to read as much material as possible, to broaden our understanding on life, and just to give us a complete understanding and just a lot of information and data that we need to apply to this world to be productive in this world. So it's principle for us of mankind to read every day. Number eight, allow yourself some time off. It's principle for us as mankind to allow ourselves off from our busy, hectic, day-to-day -day schedules and just have time to yourself to relax and to unwind and to not worry about anything and to not have a care in the world when you're allowing yourself this time off. But don't get too wrapped up into this time off because you wouldn't want this to lead to procrastination and things that are important that you should be applying your attention to. But make sure you take some time off just to gather yourself, to regroup so that you are charged and ready to come back full force. It's principle for us. I'm gonna do a recap. Number one, go to bed at a reasonable hour. Number two, wake up like clockwork. Number three, make time for grooming. Number four, show yourself who's the boss. Number five, leave work at work. Number six, give time to your loved ones. Number seven, read every day. Number eight, allow yourself some time off. It's principle for us of mankind to understand that we have to follow a daily routine in order to leave ourselves fulfilled in life. And it's in our best interest to understand that these eight suggestions that I gave you to apply to your mindset, follow these routines so that you will feel fulfilled in your life. Like, share, subscribe. Hit the notification bell to receive all of my content. Leave a comment below to let me know how you feel about this segment. Your response is highly appreciated.